today. I know sometimes things can be difficult, but I'm here for you. If you find the game too easy or too difficult, remember you can change the difficulty settings in the options section. All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome, welcome, welcome to T Gun Gaming, baby. It is Freedom Friday. And like I said before, we're going to continue. Detroit become human. Uh, this is where this is where we this is where they break out. Where they going? This is you know what? This is actually perfect for Freedom Friday because they fighting for their freedom. Let's go. Let's get into it. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. I'm glad you're here. Glad you came. Let's go. so excited to get back into this game and especially since my my ps4 uh save didn't transfer over sit down sit down This little boy. Find Lieutenant Anderson. Scanning the room. Edward MC. Wait a minute, wait a minute. And this guy right here is an awesome actor. Awesome actor. Been in, uh, 
introduce him. Lieutenant Anderson. My been name is so Tom. many movies. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. So just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. <laughs> It'll make life easier for both. I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender, the same again, please. See that gym wonders of technology. Like, all right. Make it a double. Look at that, Hank. Neutral. <laughs> He's like, all right, you ain't gonna buy me a drink. Buy me a drink. Oh. <sighs> Did you say homicide? Yeah, it's, it's time for him to at least start. He's cranky. He's sleepy. He's coming through from the mic. You wait here. You wait right there. My instructions are to accompany you to the crime scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. <laughs> I told you to wait oh. here. So okay. you shut the fuck up and you wait here. <laughs> Conflicting orders. Selecting priority. Follow Lieutenant Anderson. <laughs> Get out of there. Josh Get. Douglas for Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. Get my way. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. What part of staying in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Even at yeah. Hank, Ooh. we were starting to think you weren't going to show. Yeah, that was the plan until this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We got a call around Hank from the landlord. Lieutenant had to take his rent for a few months, so he thought he'd drop by, see what was going on. There you go. Oh my Jesus. Rolls. Smell. It was even worse before we opened the windows. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. Listen to the brief. a record for theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Well, stayed he's in. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. Could have waited till morning. Been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break in? Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't alive. here when we arrived. I, I gotta get some air. You let, you let, look, I gotta get out of here. I'll be outside if you need. Three me. weeks. Woo. I won't be able to go in. I don't. I don't even see how some people. I'll make that. Oh, like a decaying body for three weeks. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Chris, is this written in the victim's no. blood? <laughs> I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. 
Hey, hey, back up, back up. Red ice. Seems our friend Carlos liked the party. Twenty-eight knife. Oh my! This seems more than nineteen days ago. Red ice. Don't that shit, man. He's Carlos Hoti. Yes. They came from the kitchen. He was stabbed 28 times. Yeah. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. samples in real time i'm sorry i should have warned you okay just don't put any more evidence in your mouth you got it got it oh, fucking hell i can't believe this shit <laughs> oh that's so disgusting Chris, so i want full analysis on the narcotics consider it done lieutenant Right now, we're just reviewing the evidence. He's licking blood <laughs> to identify. Hey, Mike, you finished taking samples there? That's so gross. Yeah, that's it. Oh, I need to see it. That red ice. Sorry. Stabbed. First time. Ah, where you at? <laughs> ah, I got gotcha. you. Get away, man. Eden. All right now. Hey, ooh. More blood. I said, how many we got? Now we got five out of ten. from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. The tracks could have faded. No. This type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. He didn't escape this way. 
I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Where you at, man? Come on, guys, get a move on. Don't wanna be here all night. Don't wanna be here all night. Signs of a struggle. Don't worry. No one wants to stay here when they have to. Back. Fingerprint, Carlos. Theft and aggravated assault. Damn. This part be so cool. I the deviant took a knife. You do it that night. You do it that night. Deviant was attacked from emotion. Emotional damage. Android's like sufficiently better. We've reviewed all the evidence. signs of a struggle the question is what exactly happened here I think the victim attacked the Android with the bat that lines up with the evidence go on <laughs> stabbed the victim so the android was trying to defend itself right okay then what happened the victim fled to the <laughs> living the garden <laughs> We got, he got way too happy with it. All right, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim. It went from self-defense to murder real quick. With the knife. With the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. Ew, Maddox, what's good, my brother? Went. What's going on, my guy? It was Glad damaged have you, man. by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. Man, it's, it's the fluid you, that powers man. Android's bio components. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh, what's it up to? But you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. 
Correct. I can still see the blue blood. I know, right? Yeah, man. I've been, I've been on here, man. But I'm, I'm a, uh, I was just talking about it tonight, like. do my Marvel Mondays over there and also basically upload that Yeah, that's what it's looking like. Now they, uh, now they just came out with uh, live redirect, so it's basically like a raid, but a little. That's in the beta stage, and um, that's in the beta stage, and they just announced um, gifted membership. So. Place with like gifted subs and grades. YouTube. Come in. Ow. Yeah. Every time, man, I was waiting for it too. He should have stayed still, though. Like, or when he was looking over there, he, that's when he should have made his. Begging you. Don't tell them. But now this is what's crazy. So right here. If we don't reconstruct the crime. This I bet you of course says he gets leaving. Not found. Not located. I'm gonna do it one day. I haven't done that one. I've always found him. <laughs> and so now we rejoin Kara and Alice.
Dinner is ready. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. That man went straight to the pipe. There wasn't much in the kitchen. I did what I could. Androids are so fucking wonderful. Stop moving around, for Christ's sake! You're making me nervous. <laughs> what are you looking at? What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off! You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking account, damn it! It's all your fault. Daddy, no! It's all your fucking fault! Here? Come back here right now! You stay there. Don't you dare fucking move, or I'll bust you worse than last time. Don't move. I was like, uh-uh. Break free! Freedom! Back to Alan. For reason, with Todd. out of here that's an order i want you to leave her alone you want do you want what do you mean you want what are you gonna do you're gonna shoot me is that it are you gonna shoot a human you seem to have a problem i think we need to fix that <clears throat> I 
No. No. Oh. Bye bye, Todd. Could have closed the door. let me know in the comments which would you have done wait which yeah which would you have wait a <laughs> what do you what would you choose <laughs> would you have chose the gun or chose to go out the window and hide escape got to go to the bus Play some PUBG. We always go to this gear, right? What's going on, my brother? Yeah, I was never a fan was of PUBG, man. Boring party I've been to in the last never a fan. years. Every time I go to one of these, I ask myself, what the Can't hell go wrong am I with doing here? I hate cocktail parties and all the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's I a am thinking for about people who admire your work to meet you. You know, yeah, but yeah, yeah. Uh, no one gives a more damn about art. First person food is all they care about is how much money they're gonna make out of it. All of the have a drink. Oh, the excitement of this whole thing has made me thirsty. I really want to find like a good medal of honor, man. My thing was medal of honor. Scotch, neat as usual. Absolutely. No, no. The other way. The other way. Okay, but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, well, he can kiss my ass. I'm old enough to choose my own medication. Thanks for coming in, though, man. Did you leave the light on in the studio? No. Oh, no, yeah. Sir, I didn't. Yes. Call the police. Yes. Well, yeah, I mean, I know, I know, uh, PUBG is their person. But, um. Detroit Police, what's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's Android at 8941. I don't know, I was just never a fan of PUBG. Just returned home and found but I was just saying, like, in general, I'm trying to be more breaker. like shoot, shooting game. The patrol car is on the way. Let's go check it out. Rasta. Rasta. Yeah, but Army 2 is dope. Leo, what are you doing? You refused to help me, so I'm helping myself. How many did they make? It's That's crazy. The, I have two. Pay for this shit. Don't touch them. How many did? They... Look, they're all gonna be mine sooner or later, anyway. Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. Marcus, get him away from there. Get him out of here. Leo, don't make this difficult. Listen to your father. You need to leave now. All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? Not good enough for you? No, 
perfect like this fucking thing. That's enough. Get out right now. What makes it so special Ooh. anyway, huh? What's it got that I don't? Leave him alone. Come on, let's see what you got. Marcus, don't defend yourself. You hear me? Don't, don't do anything. anything. Go ahead, hit me. It sure is. is. It sure is. Man, act like one. Great, uh, um, Jesse Williams. Too much of a pussy. Stop it, Leo. Stop it. Just scared to fight back, you fucking bitch. No. I don't have to pay them. I must decide for myself. Person, you're just a fucking piece of plastic. Oh, Leo, leave him alone. Listen, leave him alone. I'll destroy you. Then it'll just be me and my dad. I'm gonna tear you. Leo. Oh my God. Leo, my little boy, Carl, I, they'll destroy you, Marcus, you gotta go, get out of here. Nowhere to go, Carl. You're all I have. Get out now. Go, Marcus. Don't fucking move. Hmm. All of this is just a little bit too familiar. <laughs> Not laughing. Police mistook, mistook, sorry, Marcus for the aggressor. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why'd you kill him? What happened before you took that knife? I love I love this scene so How long much. Were you in the attic. Why didn't you even try to run away? That happens all the time, bro. Damn. Say something. Let's not go there on this stream. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm out of here. We're wasting our time interrogating a machine. We're getting nothing out of it. Yo, it's get right. Have you ever played this? Always try roughing Have up. Have you ever played it. Detroit? After all, it's not human. Androids don't feel pain. You would only damage it, and that wouldn't make it talk. Deviants also have a tendency to self-destruct when they're in stressful situations. Okay, smartass. Good game, man. Great game. What should we do then? I could try questioning it. <laughs> <laughs> what do we have to lose? Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. You're like, all right, yeah, go ahead. Do your thing. Man, I love this scene so much. I will. No. Oh no, you didn't play this before. You know, you didn't know it was a game. Yeah, let me intimidate the witness. File. Huh. 
Now I'm sitting down. <laughs> Bro, this is such a great game. So the androids are basically like slaves. Yeah, yeah. I, I was gonna try and think of another word. Um, un, uh, the the androids are unpaid workers. <laughs> unpaid servants. Right. And um, and they basically start thinking for themselves. Start feeling emotion. Absolute AI. Caused by a baseball bat. Man, he was getting beat with a baseball bat. And he has cigarette burns on him. Look at all, look at all these burn marks. Stop playing. Reach optimal stress for confession. Let's go. You recognize him? It's Carlos. You Ortiz. know who it is? He is stabbed twenty eight times. That was written on the wall in his blood. Damaged. Did your owner do that? Did he beat you? He beat you. He put his hands on you. You've refused to talk since they arrested you. If you don't cooperate, they'll do things the hard way. Is that what you want? If you won't talk, I'm going to have to probe your memory. No! No! No, please don't do that. You ain't like that. What? What are they gonna do to me? Well... They're gonna destroy me, aren't they? Yes. They're going to disassemble you to look for problems in your bio components. They have no choice if they want to understand what happened. Why did you tell them you found me? Why couldn't you just have left me there? I was programmed to hunt deviants like you. I just accomplished my mission. Mm. I don't want to die. Then talk to me. I... I... You know, the actors and just I can't. they did a stunning performance. Everybody did. Choose a probe. Probe his memory. Pressure it. Understand. Understand how you felt. You were overcome by anger and frustration. No one can blame you for what happened. Okay then, don't talk. What do I care after all? I mean, I'm not the one accused of murder, right? If you remain silent, there's nothing I can do to help you. They're gonna shut you down for good. You'll be dead. Do you hear me? Dead. Hey, no more. 
He tortured me every day. Let's go. Got him. I did whatever he told me, but got him to talk. There was always something wrong. Then one day, he took a bat and started hitting me. Mm. For the first time, I felt scared. Scared he might destroy me. Scared I might die. So I grabbed a knife and I stabbed him in the stomach. I stabbed him again and again until he collapsed. There was blood everywhere. RA9. It was written on the bathroom wall. What does it mean? The day shall come when we will know. Slaves. Mm -hmm. No more threats. No more humiliation. We will be the masters. Revolution. Why did you write I am alive on the wall? He used to tell me I was nothing. That I was just a piece of plastic. I had to write it, to tell him he was wrong. The sculpture in the bathroom, you made it, right? What does it represent? It's an offering. An offering so I'll be saved. The sculpture was an offering. An offering to whom? To RA9. Only RA9 can save us. RA9. Who is RA9? When did you stop feeling emotion? Before he used to beat me and I never said anything. I swear it's like one big one. I realized it wasn't fair. I felt anger, hatred. And then I knew what I had to do. Why did you hide in the attic instead of running away? I didn't know what to do. For the first time, there was no one there to tell me. I was scared. So I hid. I'm done. Chris, lock it up. All right, let's go. Leave me alone. Don't touch me. What the fuck are you doing? Move it. Okay. You shouldn't touch it. It'll self-destruct if it feels threatened. Stay out of this, got it? The fucking Andrew's gonna tell me what to do. You don't understand. If it self-destructs, we won't get anything out of it. I told you to shut your fucking mouth. Gonna move this asshole or what? I'm trying. I can't let you do that. Leave it alone now. I warned you, motherfucker. That's enough. Mind your own business, Hank. I said that's enough. <laughs> You're not gonna get away with it this time. I thought he was about to shoot me. Everything is all right. 
It's over now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Please, don't touch it. Let it follow you out of the room, and it won't cause any trouble. The truth is inside. Wait, what? Yo, he's never said that to me before. See? Man, I love this game. The truth is inside. What is that? What? Oh, oh, I'm tripping now. Oh my god. Do you know if there's any other place we could spend the night? I have no idea. She's gonna have to leave. Somewhere to spend the night. Come on, Alice, we've got to hurry. Uncomfortable, but safe. Gotta get in. Comfortable, but not discreet. Need money. Mega washer. Open 24-7. But you can't stay there. You can't stay here. Won't be open for more. I never tried open. Very uncomfortable, but discreet. Shop is new. Open 24-7, can't sleep here. Ask help. Hotel, check house. Oh, oh wait. Oh.
It's warm in here. You'll feel better in no time. Dry clothes for Alice. Sorry, man. What are you doing? They're not our clothes. We need them, Alice. You need something warm, and I need to get rid of this uniform. But that's stealing. We can't do that. I'm sorry, Alice, but we have to do this. So. I've never had a problem doing this. As far as like something happened to her, but my lady said he woke up before one time. No. My cousin's wife said that. But yeah, he he woke him up. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> Like, oh, I'm gonna peel this off. Oh, Okay, where we at? All right, we got clean. We got warm clothes. Okay. So, girl, where is you going? someone who can help you. But that's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight. Let's do it. Look, the store is still open. Maybe we should go inside. At least you'll be out of the cold. Convince the cashier. Oh. 
boy for Alan. Can I help you? I'm with a little girl and we have nowhere to go. Could you spare some money so we can get a room for tonight? Look, this is a convenience store lady, not the Salvation Army. I can't start handing out cash to every bum in the neighborhood. Every bum in the neighborhood? Wait outside for me. I'll just be two minutes. Wait outside? Yeah, wait outside. You heard me, little girl. Please. Alice, just trust me. <laughs> wait outside now. Mama gotta handle her business. <laughs> about to go see a man about a dog. Sorry, but I have no choice. All right, now. Take the cash from the register. Put it on the counter. How he don't know? Oh, How he don't know this? Um, do having his hands up like this? Excuse me. Are you done? Go ahead. As soon as I walk in the store, I see him like this. I'm old. Oh. oh, I'm trying to turn around real quick. Out there, hit 911. You're like, uh, okay, thanks for the beer, bud. Open the register. Back up. Not something new, though. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm sorry, but I really need this money. Okay. Okay, how much you get? How much you get? Uh oh. <laughs> Gonna get the boy for Alice? No? I'm taking this stuffed animal with me too. register you stole it you stole it carl why did you do that why did you do that uh, uh, actual i had no choice it was the only way alice it wasn't was it? <laughs> no mommy stealing is bad Feeling is bad though, people. I wonder if I can go back in there. Can I go back in the store? Oh, I should try that. Do that. Do this thing. Hi. Oh, listen to the song in the background. I hope I don't get copyrighted for it though. That'll be forty dollars up front. 
Just need your name and address. Can I see your driver's license? We, we, we were in a rush. I think I forgot it at home. No worries. We can deal with it tomorrow. Have a good night. Good night. Think he believed you? I don't know, Alice. All I know is you'll be nice and warm tonight. Give me your coat. Let's get these clothes off. They're soaking wet. I'll just put these in the bathroom to dry. Why didn't he ever love me? Why was he always so upset with me? All I wanted was a life like other girls. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I wasn't good enough. That's why he was always so angry. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Why couldn't we just be day. happy? never leave me, right? Promise you'll never go. I promise. Will we be together forever? Forever. Their first moment. You should sleep now. I'm going to turn off the light, okay? Thank you. 
So as y'all saw right there, we could have chose so many different um, outcomes. Look at this. So, so much. Your decisions have outcomes. Cause and effect. Reboot. Reboot. You know, that used to be a cartoon. They shot him and immediately threw him in the junkyard. He's dying. He's dying. He's dead. What's wrong with you? You're dying. Compatible, let's go. Yeah. 
ape the junkyard. Not a place for me. Not a place for me. Oh my god. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho. Find, Find Jericho. Jericho. Just walking. Go. Hello. I'm an AK-700 android. I was designed to serve you. What can I do? My program has detected an anomaly. Please contact me here to find the right to make it. First time's a charm. Let's go, baby. End it.
Wait, please. Please don't do that. I want to live. Thank you. He's like, Give me that. Climb the slope. Get it. Feel here. Feel strong. Android, no more. Ah. Just hanging in, you know. Like really? Really? But this is gonna be a nice little place just to take a quick little break. Don't go nowhere.
with more T-Gunner Gaming coming up.
All right, all right. We're back. So we have to find Amanda. There she is. Hello, Amanda. Connor, it's good to see you. Congratulations, Connor. Finding that deviant was far from easy. And the way you interrogated it was very clever. You've been remarkably efficient, Connor. Thank you, Amanda. We've asked the DPD to transfer it to us for further study. It may teach us something about what happened. The interrogation seemed... challenging. What did you think of the Deviant? Well... It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This... Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the Deviancy case. What do you make of him? He's obviously not what I was expecting. But I don't have enough information yet to form a definitive opinion. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? I will focus on the investigation and try to ignore him. As long as he doesn't interfere and we avoid conflict, he shouldn't be a problem. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. You can count on me, Amanda. Hmm? Hurry, Connor. There's little time. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Connecting. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. I believe, did we just make out? <laughs> what just happened? I'm looking for Lieutenant Anderson's right. desk. It's that desk right there. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. <laughs> if we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. He's like, yeah, I can't sit here. <laughs> Go see the DV. Oh, wow. Uh... Oh, 
Oh, wow. I'm sorry. It's not what I wanted. But there's nothing I can do. I know there's something you didn't tell me. I need to know before they take you away. The sculpture you made. Tell me more about it. Oh, Lord. Open the cell, quick! Hurry! I'll call Cyberlife. Clean this mess up. The truth is inside. Inside what? Now you committed suicide. Come on, man. Right. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office. He's a hero. you to investigate these cases and see if there's any why me why do i gotta be the one to deal with this shit i am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case i know jack shit about androids jeffrey 
I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. CyberLife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way! I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me uh, off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. I would like to start reviewing the case files. Can you tell me where I talk to Hank? Close the door on your way out. Have a nice day, Captain. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that. Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. All right, don't In any case, I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. <laughs> Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair is on your chair. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? Sumo. I call him Sumo. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah, too long. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such. But I'd like to. <laughs> but I'd like to. I was wondering, do you always arrive at the office at this time? I arrive when I arrive. Stop busting my balls, okay? <laughs> Lab report says they cut it with something. All right. All right. If you have any files on deviance, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminals on your desk. Knock yourself out. Two hundred and forty-three files. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. 
An AX-400 is reported to have murdered a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. I wish they came out with a sequel for this. That'd be dope. That'd be dope. And it'd be a must-have. I know you didn't ask for this investigation, Lieutenant. But I'm sure you're a professional. Why don't you go fuck yourself? I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Uh, Lieutenant? I'm sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that killed the guy last night. It's been sighted in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. He's like, he put his hands on me. <laughs> he looked destroyed. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to wake you. So it wasn't a nightmare. <laughs> no. No, it wasn't a nightmare. How about a nice warm bath? And then we can go out and try to get you something to eat. What do you say? Okay. I'll run you a bath. Man, that tub filled up quick. Turned it on and turned it off. Black or blonde?
look like a human now. You bastard. Yep. Oh my goodness. There we go. The victim's name was Todd Williams, an unemployed man from Corktown. According to initial reports, he was shot by his android, an AX-400. The android fled the scene, and a police search is now in progress. Reporting live for Channel 16 News, I'm Josh Douglas. You had no choice. He would have killed me if you hadn't stopped him. What are we gonna do? We have nowhere to go. And the police are looking for us now. We can't stay here. We don't have any money. That android yesterday, he gave me an address. He said we could get help there. Could be worth a try. We can't change the past, Alice. But we can decide the future. We're gonna pull through, and soon all this will just be a bad memory. Finish getting ready. I'll go out and find some food for you, and then we can get going. Get breakfast for Alice. Whoop! There's Connor and Hank right there. Lieutenant Anderson, Detroit Police. Looking for a female android robbed a store down the road last night. You seen anything? An android? No. I don't take androids here. Have you seen anyone that looks like this? Fuck. I knew there was something weird about her. She came in last night. She was dressed normal, you know? There was no way I could tell. Is it still here? Yeah, probably. Room 28. Thank you. <sighs> Still at the motel. Says we gotta form some cordon off the area and head to his room. You wait in the car. Out of the question. I'm coming with you. Listen, I'm tired of you talking back to me. You're a machine, so shut the fuck up and do what I say. All I want is to accomplish my mission. I'm sorry if that upsets you. You wanna see the end of your mission? Stop busting my fucking balls. They're headed for the train station. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, Connor. They're over there. It's funny. I, oh, my goodness. 
It's funny how they ain't even try to stop him. We're over that way. I can't take that chance. Now you will get yourself killed. Do not go after it, Carter! God damn it! Oh. Oh. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm thinking it up right now. That truck just took Connor away, didn't it? Oh my goodness gracious. Woo. Connor was hit by the car. <laughs> oh Lord. Several sources report that Cytolife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have He's like, how is he over there? Jericho. Over there, look contemplating life right there.
So right now we're finding clues to locate Jericho. Which is supposed to be an Android safe haven. Man, I wish fences just unraveled like that. It's the revolution. How are you going to get across, Marcus? How are you going to get across? I'm a dumb. Yo, what's up, Gunch? How you doing? Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a good, uh, well, I hope you had a good day. Can I, can I expect you, uh, tomorrow, uh, tomorrow for, uh, playing Saturday?
Let's do it. Nice little workout. I guess that's a no. Not coming tomorrow. Back. Can't put nothing back. The boat. Oh, <laughs> not going that way. Leap of faith. Android on the run.
bad is they made it like, clunk gentlemen and that's gonna be the stream for tonight ah. it's been fun as always we are definitely going to be continuing this next week um so stay tuned keep the notifications turned on make sure you hit that like hit that subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you in the next stream <laughs>